Hey, what's up everybody? This is Jeremy here with OCE Recycling and today we'll be having a look at what's inside floppy disk drives. If at any point you enjoy this video, please don't hesitate to like and subscribe, leave a comment, and share with your friends. Without any more delay, let's get started. So this is our main board for the floppy disk drive and as you can see aside from a couple IC chips there's really nothing else of value. This is the little motor that ejects the floppy disk. All drives are going to have one of these. This is just the top half of the disk reader. We'll get a closer shot of the whole thing later on. Now all that's left to take out is the main motor. And all we're left with is an empty shell of steel and a bit of plastic. So let's get started on the next one. As you can see, this one's a little bit different, but the components are pretty much the same. Here we were able to get the disc reader out complete, so this is what it looks like when it's normally put together. This drive looks like the oldest of the three due to the size of the board and the actual motor. Still really nothing of value though. Well, the motor was a pain to disassemble, but I finally got the top taken apart, which means I can unscrew the base.
this here is just a solid piece of number one copper. And with that one taken apart, this video is just about done. Here's a quick uh, size comparison of all the boards. Uh, other than that, like I said in the beginning, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.